So it's me Lexi and welcome back to my channel for Let's Play The Sims 3 Ambitions part. I don't know. Um, as you can tell from my voice, I just said this in Generations, but if you haven't watched that, then you don't know. But I'm sick. Um, so if I sound weird, that's why. I was also supposed to be in I'm supposed to be in class right now, but I'm so sick. And then I had Mexican and I was actually dying like my stomach felt like it was gonna explode but today we're here with our generations family which is always generations family oh my god ambitious family which is always exciting one of my favorite freaking let's plays and families like ever they're just a lot of fun can you put him away please put winter away sister put away winter um yeah so she's done with our peanut butter and jelly sandwiches so i think we're just gonna call everyone to the meal because like we're all hungry okay did she just put that back there okay um anyway yeah so why don't you what time do you work you don't have work today okay well you need to get up anyway so he's gonna go ahead and get up eat and use the bo the body <laughs> about the body the potty and we really need to go out and introduce ourselves to people he knows like nobody <laughs> she doesn't know hardly anyone either but it'd be like that sister i did not tell you to put those up i don't know why my game is oh it's because i'm rendering a video oops all right well she's gonna go ahead and eat some peanut butter and jelly sandwiches and then he's gonna come eat some as well when he's done and then i think these two might go out on a little little winter fall date or no no, it's Sunday. We'll go out. Um, yeah, we're going to go out. Um, he does have work tomorrow, so we're not going to, like, do too much. Uh, but I kind of want to go to the casino and get some more money. I know we have, like, almost 20,000 simoleons, which is so good, actually. Like, it's actually so good. Um, I'm kind of, like, shook. But, like, I still want to go out and get more, you know? I just feel like I never have enough. But yeah, we're going to go continue our sculpture with Tris whenever she's done. And she's just going to kind of do that for the night. Tomorrow we'll go get some uh, more supplies and whatnot. But yeah, I do need to give them like kind of wintry makeovers. I don't know if I will or not though. Like, I mean, I think they look good in my opinion. Sister, move. Why don't you get in there with him? Have a good woohoo. No. Get in there woohoo. Do a risky woohoo. If they get pregnant, I ain't even upset. <laughs> like, I want a baby with them so bad. <laughs> uh, I want a baby. That's so bad. I need to wait. I need to relax. Um, but yeah, we're going to come over here, I think. And I was going to say, watch some TV. Bitch, you got no TV. Um, just wait a second. He just has to potty. And then we're going to go and probably go to this casino right here with Claudia and Damien are you you and Merlin are pretty good he's wanting oh heck no what the frick stop you know are some weirdos why don't you go and invite over Marlena and have her come over and maybe they can woohoo or something in the shenane or maybe we can actually I feel like Damien would be really romantic you know like uh dinner dates like to fancy restaurants even when he can't afford it buying her stuff and getting her flowers and just like romantic but he's not gonna put that like he's not gonna like put that on like as a front I guess he won't front I don't know how to explain it so am I even saying like the right term knowledge I don't even know but I'm like I don't know but I just feel like that's kind of what he'd be like. Romantic. Once you get to know him. And I think that's why Trish is... Trish. <laughs> Trish would really love him. You know? And that's kind of the tea. Alright, why don't you go ahead and sell that. And then, um... You can go ahead and just... Start working on a new one. Oh, we can do ice now. Yes! Yes! What are you ordering? Why, is, why are we having no money right now? He's playing high stakes. He is. Okay, buddy. You better win the lotto. We're not. The lotto. This is not the lottery. Sorry. <laughs> um, I swear I'm fine. Alright, why don't you come over here and also play some high stakes right next to your mans. And he might have to go get a drink. I think he needs to not be on this one. You know? I don't think we're doing great, sweetie. Yeah, no, we're not doing good. All right, why don't you go order, like, a Caribbean cooler, whatever. We lost Diney Simoleons because of him. Thanks, buddy. Um, yeah, I don't think we're doing good either. She's, like, so stressed while doing this. What the heck? Okay, yeah, we'll stop, I guess. The heck is that? 
All right, why don't you come over here and kiss him? And we'll flirt with him. We will compliment his appearance and give him an amorous hug. And I think this chick is here, maybe. Let's see. I don't see her, so maybe she kind of like stood us up. <laughs> True tea. I don't know, to be honest with you. Why don't you actually stop so that way he can come down here and like talk to you for a second? Um, but like, I think she stood me up and Tris is going to be like, she might have, dude. I mean, it happens. I wouldn't stress out too much about it. She's like kind of just brushing it off. Like, I don't know what you want me to tell you, buddy. So yeah, we're just going to talk to her for a second and then we'll... Then we'll go upstairs and work on our logic skill because that'll help us with our career. And she'll use the bathroom and probably just go to bed. I think these two are actually going to come home um, and just chillax. Go to sleep because they do have work tomorrow. So I didn't want them to go out for too long anyway um, because of that, you know. But yeah, like he gets to stay up because <laughs> he, he needs to stay up until at least like 2 a.m. Which is kind of the worst thing ever but oh well but yeah these two are gonna go to sleep oh my god i've had a woohoo last that lasted longer than that day if you're going to ask me you should actually spend some time with me honey to be fair he didn't really ask you y'all are insane these two are like a roller coaster and a half i swear um yeah that's kind of crazy but yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and skip until the morning, and I will see you guys then. Okay, guys, so good morning. It is now 8 a.m., and we're getting ready to kind of go to work and stuff like that. But before um, Claudia starts on any of her work, I'm actually going to buy her a computer and just kind of get her, like, her desks set up kind of going because um, she will kind of have to do that. So, yeah, let's go ahead and get that for her. Let's see get her like a pretty nice computer you know we have the money why not we'll get her like a nice little bookshelf to go up here uh, we'll get her this one it matches good with the desk and then we need a plant plants are essential <laughs> uh, can I go up there no I don't even know why I thought that I'm pressing the wrong button I want her to be able to read it <laughs> just a little reminder that you're doing great sweetie we'll put that in there and a little little rug like a little runner like one of these something like this would be good alrighty kind of put that like like that beautiful she's gorgeous she's really not but we won't tell her that um and then she's gonna go play some computer games because she's so stressed out um she actually does need to use the bathroom before it looks like she actually wants to try again and go on a date with Nick. And Nick also rolled the want last night to go on a date with him. So, or her. <laughs> oh my God. Sorry, Claudia. Um, so we'll have to try again maybe later tonight. I do, I don't know. I wonder how many dates they've gone on. Let me see. Um, went to a dance club, repair sink. Doesn't say. Um, well, they've been in a relationship for 11 days, so... That's pretty good. Hmm. That's pretty good. I wish it would tell me how many dates they've been on. I think it's around four or five even. It's quite a bit actually. Like I could expect an engagement ring maybe in the spring. I definitely don't want them getting married in this winter weather. Um, because I just don't. <laughs> So, yeah, we're definitely going to have to look into that. But he's going to go ahead and head to work. The carpool doesn't like to come, so we have to do this manually. I always make sure I am looking at the clock in the morning when I know he has work. So, yeah, but we're going to go ahead and try to repair this a little bit because I'm not having that. We're going to mop up the puddle whenever we're done. And then I think she'll go downstairs and work on her sculpture a little bit. I really don't want her to have to go outside in the super snowy weather. Um, just because, you know, who would want to and like dig up trash? Nobody. But so we'll follow Nick for, for today. We'll go on a little excursion with him and I'll probably have to fix up everything because after the weekend comes around and goes around, it's everything needs maintained. So it's actually not that bad. They're all in the 70s, 70, so it shouldn't take too long as this. That's Alistair and there's Addie. 
Um, so yeah, we'll just go do this. And hopefully a fire will erupt and well, kind of hopefully, but also like, sorry if it does, you know, um, but we're going to also improve the horsepower on this bad boy. And yeah, because this ain't the tea. It goes so slow. You would think of like all the cars in this game, the fire truck would go the fastest or at least fast. Um, because like you kind of got to get where you're going, you know what I'm saying? Um, like this ain't no joke. Claudia. You kind of snapped. All right, honey, you can go report your into that dude. Um, and he's up now. It's 12 p.m. I'm so glad. I'm so glad you're deciding to join to join us now. What the? Fuck? Oh, he's making the bed. Okay. Um, why don't you go eat? And then you can come up here and work on your chest. And she's just gonna keep doing this. I might just purchase some scrap because we have the money. Do I want to spend, you know, 550 spillions? No. Am I going to? Well, I already did. So, yeah. Um, but, yeah. Where is Claudia? Okay. Uh, yeah. Honey, go report in. Why don't they listen? I don't know. You, like, actually have to, like, follow them. It's kind of annoying. Oh, there's a fire. Okay, there's a fire. Ha, 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 ha. Where's that? <laughs> it's all the way out here. These mansions, I swear, are the worst. Okay, go here. And then we're going to put this out. I don't even know if we actually technically can. Hopefully, we're not driving out here for nothing. So, yeah, let's put out the large, large house fire. Perfect. This fire is simply horrible. The most terrifying thing I've ever experienced. Please save me, my home, and my family. Oh, that's kind of sad. Okay, extinguish this. Extinguish this. Let's see if there is any more fire. If it's just those two. Looks like it's just those two. So it's really not that bad. I mean it's bad because it's like a large house fire. But you know. Okay I hear more fire. Where is it? Okay I think it's. No. Oh my god. Okay okay no there's one over here. Go extinguish this. Run. Okay, now come in here and break down this door. Honey, what? Sister! What the fuck? No! Uh-uh! What the fuck? No, okay. Convince him to run. Convince her to run. And then convince him to run. Even though he's like outside. Hey, this is Clayton! This is one of the sims I made in my for my base sims. He's cute. Um, he wants to save Clayton from death, so we will actually go do that. Um, oh, we actually got a little thing. Magical gnome. Oh my gosh. Good job. What do we get? I don't even know what we got. <laughs> I think we got a B, to be honest with you. But we're going to go back to the station and continue working. Claudia, I believe, is somewhere. Yeah, she's doing whatever. She doesn't know what she's doing. Um, so yeah, we're going to have her go and talk to him. Looks like she actually made a toilet. So that's really freaking cool. Let's go ahead and take a look at that. Where did it go? It's an ice sculpture of a toilet. We can use it? No way. Uh-uh. I don't believe you. We're going to go in the middle of the freaking living room and do it because there's no room in our house. Go here and use this. That would be so cool on your cheeks. Oh, I didn't read that! Damn it. Where are you going, honey? Stop. Wait, you know what? Let me try putting it where this one is. So we'll put this one in our family inventory. And we'll put this one here. And we'll we'll go take a little poopy on the scoopy. Okay, let me read this real quick. Um, where'd it go? Opportunities. Inspect mail and search through garbage. Seamus Judge is convinced Mark Brandit is trying to hack into the public library databases. A stalwart defender of public librarians. Libraries. Oops. Seamus Judge wants you to gather evidence by inspecting the mail and searching the trash at Mark Bandit's home. So let's go ahead and go over here to his house and do just that. We'll come search and search. And he is back at the fire station. There's so many sims to like 
go around and y'all wanted me to have more the hell or less but like <laughs> seven careers like how are you um all right well let's go ahead and see what she's doing i think he's getting ready to go he does have work in an hour um why don't you go ahead and use this bathroom i don't think she actually can go here use this uh nope i don't think she can it's just it's just gonna keep doing that do that laundry <laughs> uh, so yeah we'll just sell it that's totally fine um sells for more than our real toilet so that's amazing but yeah we're just gonna do the laundry because it's really freaking bad it wouldn't even let us put that in there and then she's gonna go serve up some dinner we'll serve up some autumn salad he's gonna go perform that job there's actually three today so look at us go um let me see he's working out why don't you head home he wants to save someone from death. He wants to save five sims. We have to save 30 all in all. Why don't you actually go collect your service award? Go home. Claudia's doing that. Okay. Oh my god. All right. And then we will. Let's see. Okay. And I think he's there actually. There's something wrong in my house. It's not a gas leak or a smell, but a ghost, I think. Because you scan around for and uh, try to find it so we have to actually find ghosts so Marlene is here this bitch is always everywhere that i go uh turns out shameless wild suspicions were correct i found receipts for library hacking software and a modern and a modem specifically designed for library database infiltration i should return this information to shamish shamish <laughs> Oh, look at that. She got a little magical gnome of image. That's really cute. All right, well, we're going to actually go report our findings. And can we please go inside? Scan for ghosts. All hail Nick Hero of Twinbrook. In recognition of your heroic deeds in service of the fire department, I am proud to present you with a the firefighter's trophy of honor. Oh, my God, look at his face. He's so cute. Um, you have saved the lives of two innocent sims. May you save the lives of many more. Thank you, hero. Look at how effing hot he is. I'm sorry. Alrighty. Oh, and Claudia got a promotion. Awesome. Oh, we saw the ghost of Amelia something. Oh my god. Who is this? Amelia Stubblefield. She looks old. Oh my god convince her to move on who's this i don't know convince him to move on there's so many ghosts heck no convince him to move on the gym has gotten pretty cold a presence can be felt nearby oh he's disliked okay you know what that's okay Go ahead and banish her as well. I'm not dealing with them. We'll just banish them. Hey. Right. Does that work? Okay, good. I couldn't tell. Uh yeah, that's a lot actually. We went from spirits to ghosts real quick, sister. And we're gonna be level six maybe after this evening, which would be really awesome. Can you please just report in? It's it ain't even that deep. Where are we? I don't know, but there's freaking showers here. What the heck? Oh, this is a bar. I was like, what the heck? Yeah, we're gonna go do that. And I think he's home now. Yeah, she's also home. Let's go over here and make sure that he gets some food in his belly instead of just making snowmen outside and in our tuxedo. <laughs> um, so yeah, we'll go inside and shower use the bathroom and grab some food and tomorrow what do we work tomorrow 10 a.m to 6 p.m we are really close to a promotion which will get us to level six kind of a lot and i love that so sister banish and you didn't talk to him no i'm done with you talk to him now 
Um, build six hydrogen areas and deliver them to the military, ba military base for a reward and inventing skill boost in relationship boost with the military. Yes, ma'am. Hopefully we can do that. All right. Now we are done with his house. So let's go ahead and go on to the next one. Oh, we have a service reward. Oh, uh-uh. Don't waste your money here or your time here. Ain't nothing good. All right, go banish those spirits and see if she's actually going to do it now. Hmm, we'll see. Oh, I hear ghosts. I think this place is haunted. I think this place is literally haunted. I think he's actually coming here. Oh, no, he's going here. Well, honey, go visit the Drudge household. Okay, and then report findings to him. Like, why was that so hard? I don't know. And it took actually forever. Damien is here. Act, these spirits are everywhere in this house. I am on the edge here and cannot concentrate. Please catch them before I lose my mind. Um, so I have to banish spirits. So um, he knows where one of them is. Uh, Seamus Judge was quite pleased when I presented the evidence of Mark Bannon's crime. Case closed, assuming Seamus Judge knows what to do with the evidence. Cool, cool, cool. So, yeah, you can go home, Claudia. And what is this? Talk about the cold. Whatever. Um. Oh, look at that! An orange boy! Ooh, what's going on? Uh -huh. Did you swipe that? Good job. And there is actually all of them outside. So let's go ahead and um, banish, banish, and banish. Oh, we got a light. Are you kidding? He's so fast. Like, he literally is so fast. I love that for him. Go in here and swipe something. What are you taking? A chair. Okay. Swipe. Can you please? What is that? <gasps> yes! Good job! Oh, my God. A promotion. Oh, my God. Okay. Hold on. Let me go do this real quick. Okay. She's making, what are you making, mac and cheese? Congratulations, Damien has been conferred the new title of Ghost Grabber by the Twinburg Town Council in recognition of his valuable contributions to the workforce. Thanks to your professional and paranormal services you've delivered to this town, members of the community now look to you with respect rather than chuckles and laughter. Your work is even starting to turn some of the staunchest skeptics of eternal deliverance. <laughs> God. Go forth and keep up the good work, Ghost Grabber. Damien Valentine has received the Land Grab Industries Ghost Hunting Uniform Mark II. His advanced ectopolymer resistant construction mates washing out ectoplasm stains is cinch. Uh, we now make 840 simoleons and work 5 p.m. to 3 a.m. still. Which, of course, like I wouldn't expect. What? Oh my god. Oh my god. I've never seen this one before. That is so freaking cool. Yo, that's kind of scary though. Um. You see that? You see that triangle? Y'all know what that means. Mm hmm Y'all know what that means. Illuminati who? All right, sister, you need to go to sleep. You have work in the morning. I don't know why you're not already a bit in bed. You can go to sleep. Like, stop napping. All right, we are going over to the next house with Damien. We only have to find two ghosts and banish those. We want to donate 50 spirits to the science center. To science. Just science. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we can probably do that, but... Um, we'll go ahead and go over there to this house and hopefully find these spirits. Maybe if we can like even go inside. Hello? Okay, I don't know why it won't let me go scan for spirits. Honey! Okay. I don't care. <laughs> Go home. Whatever. I guess it's gone now. True tea. Um, yeah. So she's going to bed. She's going to bed. Everybody's going to bed. Why aren't you in bed? It says you are. Oh, you know. I'm just crazy. You know what? Love that for me. Um, anyways, I'm going to go ahead and end this part here, you guys. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and leave it a thumbs up and subscribe. I love you guys, and I'll see you all next time. Bye, everybody.